Hello everyone, this is Dice again from Anime Oasis Reborn, and this tutorial is going to be in Adobe Photoshop um, 7.0 on the Slice tool. Um, this is the picture that I use in my site. Um, so I'll just use the same one as in the site tutorial. The Slice tool you will find about here and to use it really all you do is you click it you can also have slice select tool which I'll explain later but I'm going to put this into four slices the size doesn't really matter you can have them whatever you want but this is what I have. Um, the fourth one automatically does it, but I like to make mine blue, so... The slice select tool, you can select them by double clicking, and you get the name of it. This will be the document name. Normally it's untitled one if you haven't yet saved it, but this is what I saved it as. Um, and then it gives you a 1. This type, image, no image. This is an image, so I'm going to keep it. If it was no image, it wouldn't give me anything. Uh, you could have it linked to something automatically, like I could put in... Or the target, which could be... The alt tag would just be if you hover over it, um, and message text is just text that other people, I believe, will be able to read also. I usually ignore this one because it's not important. This will tell you the width. It is 99 in width and 223 in height. Background color. There is no slice background type. If you're done with it, then you just hit OK. If you go up to File, you want to Save for Web, which will come up with a screen like this. The only really important things is that you need this unoptimized. and I'm only going to be messing with the stuff over here. This will show you the different slices. There are four. Um, as far as over here, these are the different file types that you can have. I want mine to be this, which automatically look, gives you 60. Um, these will highlight differently. like They look a bit whiter if they're not selected, but if you just drag it, it selects them all. If I put this on high, you can change the optimization. I could have it this if I wanted. Or this. You'll notice that it changes over here as you change the optimization. Um, this will t show you the optimization or not. And once you're done with this, it, it says unnamed here, but it's going to save it as this. It works just fine. You, this will just give you, like, this one is 60, this one's 80, 30, 10. High is probably the best one. Also, the nice thing about this is if you look at the bottom. I don't have room on my screen, but down in the bottom left hand corner it will tell you the type of file it is how what the size is and how long it will take to load and in the bottom right of this area it will tell you the quality which would be the optimized number when you're done you just hit save it will give you the HTML 
and the images so you don't have to piece them back together on your own you can the computer does that for you the only thing about 7.0 is the fact that it will save in HTML so if you're going to use X HTML you're going to have to make all the capital letters lowercase and put all the quotations in um, when you it will not show up with these blue things on your slices you will get a full image like this now the picture itself it is four images but uh, that is a slice tool and I hope this tutorial helps